all right we're back with some more rivals and today i wanted to talk about a specific feature that only mobile users and consoles have which is indeed auto shoot so this is what it is right here pretty much you guys have also been annoyed by it a lot of you pc users you know it says it right there not available for pc at all for no you know mouse and keyboard not available you guys have been very annoyed by this feature especially against console users and mobile users so today i wanted to just see is this truly super op because i normally play with it but i don't really think myself it's super op so let's just get on with it all righty so here's some let's get going all right let's see because like i put in my crosser like this already 100 damage let's switch over a little over well i mean like guys i really don't believe auto shoot is super op remember you guys we might have auto shoot for mobile and stuff Bruh. oh my god what on earth <laughs> there's no way guys i most of the 1v1s i do people don't even talk we just 1v1 that's it uh, that's pretty much auto shoot but like you guys have already seen it all but like true you guys it is also it does take skill because like straight up if you have auto aim and stuff auto shoot but you have horrible you know basically um pretty much horrible you're just um you suck basically at shooting then you can't really hit him because like if your aim is horrible you won't be able to hit him because auto aim or shoot just really takes aim and that girl should have just rage quit it on me let me get into more matches to show you guys. All right, if you guys didn't know, yes, Docs is my favorite map, but also the map that I'm really best at because I'm well versed with it now. All right, there he is. But auto shoot really would not save you all the time. Yes, it is very OP, and a lot of you know other people complain about it. At the same time, it will not always save me, you know, because it can literally shoot at the slightest movement of the person, which is very very OP. It will instantly give you the win. It's the reason I've been winning a lot, but at the same time though, you know, it takes aim and the correct way to use your crosshair. This is how I liked it. I explained it in the last video because this crosshair, I believe, is just overall best. Well, for me at least. Someone's got a sniper. Like, yeah, I remember now I cannot zoom in with the um what is it i can't zoom in with my revolver unfortunately i can only spam it in my showcase video and my last revolver but overall auto shoot is very easy to use oh shoot it gives you all the advantages but at the same time though you know like i you guys see i have to aim it Cause like, let me do a quick example. If I shoot all over the place without trying to aim, I'm not gonna hit anything. Like if my aim is not good, like look, see, like if I'm just doing like something like that or something, see, it's, the auto shoot doesn't work. You hit, you can shoot, but like the shots won't hit. Speaking of that, he's using sniper. Speaking of that, I forgot to mention, there is a sniper video of me using it coming up. I'm just trying to grind up the keys since I don't grind rivals too often. If I grind it all the time, then I would have been like a level 100 now, but no. You guys, like, I'm able to hit him just the slightly little head part right there. Auto shoot will hit at the tiniest. It can be a little tiny inch or centimeter of their head sticking out. It will fire and most likely hit. Level up. So the summary on this one is pretty much auto shoot is yes indeed unfair but at the same time though it's also fair we're mobile users i actually um just i mean like probably an hour ago you know i went up against the second dude on the leaderboard for the highest streak guys the score was three to five i got to two and then he caught up with two and then i got another one but then he started obliterating me I guess because I just got too predictable with my abilities and also I was getting so stressed out and hyped because it was literally the the second highest streak in the game. But no worries. I didn't win unfortunately. I almost had him though. I don't know what this guy's doing. He's lagging or something. Yes, auto shoot is fun, but also very um satisfying. Because you, when you hit those shots, it feels nice. Let me see, you try to use a first person. I don't play in first person only because I can't see too much and my accuracy is not the best. 
Revolver is different though. See, look, like the tiniest part of the head, I will literally hit it right there. Oh, I'll come to you, buddy. The tiniest part, it will hit. Tiniest, like you have your arm sticking out like where you can barely see it, it will still shoot. No matter what, because that's auto shoot. We've had this feature a lot in many other games, like also, um, what, Bad Business too. I'm pretty sure I remember having it. See, like, uh, in first person, it's a little hard for me to aim, because this crosser is not as easy to use. It's not even a crosser, the scope-wise. I don't know what he is doing. And auto-shoot makes headshots, like, ten times easier. Right, come on, buddy, come out. Was that supposed to be a distraction? Probably. Nope. A few moments later. Dude, this is rivals, not hide and seek. Eventually. Hello. And that's a victory for me. So this is pretty much it. So I wanted to just mainly talk about how like auto shoot could be unfair, but also fair at the same time. As we are mobile and stuff, we have less, you know, small of a screen. So we don't see as much as y'all do. We don't have the same features. But you know, guys, at the end of the day, the game gave what on earth? Infinite. Oh, I think that thing is broken. Okay, well, at the end of the day, the game gave it to us. And like, if you're PC users, you guys cannot be trash talking to something that the game gave us. If you want to trash talk about the auto shoot, go report it to the devs and ask them to remove it. And I could actually agree, if auto shoot was removed, probably every mobile user will start struggling. But at the same time, we're going to learn to adapt like I always do. This is all. I really hope you guys enjoy. And uh, as you guys see, I'm at uh, 39 keys and the sniper is about 75. So stay tuned for that. I'm going to try to grind at least a little bit more today. And that'll be pretty much it. I'm going to go chill and other stuff. I'll try to keep you guys updated on AUT as well. Make sure you guys subscribe. We're trying to reach 5,000 subs before around August 10th. Yeah, around there before I have to go back to school. Well, make sure you guys subscribe. Peace out.